Hey YouTube, in this video we're going to be looking at the cubes I got for my birthday. So my birthday was a little bit ago. Also before we get into the video, I'd like to mention that aside from my birthday, it's also the two year anniversary of DG Cubes being on YouTube. Which is really awesome. So, yeah, there's that. And before we get onto the cubes, another thing I got for my birthday is the tripod I'm using right now, and it gives a more top down view, which is really cool. So, tell me what you think about this view if you prefer it to like the view I've been doing lately where it's like a little lower down. Tell me what you think in the comments, because I think I'm gonna stick with it. And I got some cool cubes. So, first, I'm gonna show you a, f a clip of uh, some cubes I got at the Doylestown competition from my friends. So here's that clip. Hey, how do I open it? How do I open it? Hey, YouTube! Hey, YouTube. Hey, YouTube. Hey, YouTube. Hey, YouTube. I got a present present. Whoa, whoa, what's going on here? And we have a present. Dane is a present! Wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute. And I'm filming. Oh, yeah, you're random. Three cubes, outweigh for a long time. In the, in the, in the, I'm in the. Daniel, aka DG Cubes, aka, I don't Make know who that is. Make this a separate video. Let's see. Yeah. 66 experiments. Six, 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 He's still starting somewhere in the USA. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Right. <laughs> I don't know how to open this. Just peel the tape. Oh, off. here we go. I just, Does I anyone just have any? Just, <laughs> just use a pyramid. I have a... Yeah. Yeah. I have a... Yeah. 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 Use the edge of a cube. It'll just be it. I have a key. He didn't know it. A birthday present for Daniel. What? Oh, no. Adam, you're... <laughs> he got a claw! Oh Yay! Yeah. 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 A huge A pyramid! Oh, yeah. I'm supposed to know it at the bottom. IQ. I got you. Well, IQ. Like you. He got a clock, his favorite event! Oh, yeah. Alright. Alright. Happy birthday- Comic Sans, I love the Comic Sans. Yeah. Comic yeah. Sans! Yeah. Yeah. Going well. If it is not, we're sure it will get a whole lot better when you unbox these new puzzles. We know how much you love pyramid, so we've decided to get you the best one on the market. <laughs> QJ is so yeah. good! Uh, Clock is for sure your favorite event. That was the one that I predicted like months ago, but yeah. yes, I had no idea. That literally the, the eye cube. <laughs> because you use Windows Phone. Wow. Thank you so much, guys. That's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> And Thanks, and happy, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Okay, so now that you've seen that, here are those cubes uh, in person. Uh, where, here we go. Here are those. It's uh, the Lingao clock, which I have since learned how to solve. Um, I stand by that clock should not be an event, but I will say it's still kind of fun. Um, the eye cube. Click on it right now to watch Adam's hilarious video about it. It's a really good video at one JR Cubers contest. And the QJ Pyraminx, which is by far the best Pyraminx on the market. So yeah, that was a those were very interesting birthday presents. So now let's move on to what I got from my family and stuff. So the first thing I'm gonna talk about is the 2x2 mirror cube. And so this is really cool. And it's by, I forget what brand actually, but it's actually really smooth. Surprisingly smooth, actually, for a non WCA type puzzle. And it's actually a lot of fun, and I really enjoy playing around with this. So that's really cool, and I really like it so far. Next is the Moyu Hua Chuang 5x5, because. I had a Moyu Aochuang, except at Doylestown I lost it, and I'm convinced somebody must have taken it from me, unfortunately, because I know I brought it with me, but I didn't take it out of my backpack once, and then when I was checking to make sure I had all my cubes at the end of the competition, it wasn't there. So, I don't know, but at least it was an excuse for me to get a better 5x5, which is the Hua Chuang, and it's actually really, really nice, and I like it. So that's cool. Now onto the 4x4 windmill. Now this cube is by Moyu, and it's really new. I don't know if I've seen any videos on it, actually, but it's really cool, and I really enjoy solving it, but there is a weird thing about it. Um, when you try to do PLL parity, when you do the algorithm for it, it affects the center orientation, which is bad, because center orientation actually matters on this cube. So that's really annoying. I haven't found any um, PLL parity algorithms that don't affect that yet, but that's mainly because I haven't looked that hard. 
if you know anything and want to help me save and want to save me the search, you can leave it in the comments. That that would be greatly appreciated. And now on to the Moya Wheel of Time. This is really really awesome. It's it turns super smoothly, and it's just really fun to play around with. And also the it has wheels in case you didn't know, and these do turn independently. And that really is fun. It's kind of great because it's not really that hard if you can solve a 3x3 three three and a 5x5 five five because it's basically a 3x3 three three with 5x5 five five centers in the middle. So if you can solve those, it's really not hard, but it is really fun to play around with, and I have found myself solving this quite a bit since I've gotten it. So, yeah, this is really fun. And also it definitely helps that it turns just like you'd expect a Moyu cube would, which is really excellent. And now the final cube I got for my birthday is the Nano Cube. So, I had a video on this yesterday, of my assembly of it. Let's focus in on it. Well, the camera doesn't really want to focus on it, but you can see it basically from here. It's really, really cool. It's so small. If you want to compare it to a 5x5, five five, it's basically a little bit bigger than a corner cubie. And on a 3x3, three three, it is actually smaller than a standard cubie size which is crazy. So this is really cool. I'd highly recommend that you get this. It's really fun to assemble and sticker, and it's only $8 on the cubicle. And it also comes with, like, free lube and a free stand and stuff like that. So that is really cool. So these are all the cubes I got for my birthday. They're pretty awesome. Um, especially the iCube, QJ Pyraminx, and Clock. Um, yeah. <laughs> so big shout out to my friends who gave those to me. Uh, I'll have links to their channels in the description. But yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on my next video.